Hi guys and welcome back to another video. Hope everybody's doing well. So this video guys is going to be understanding Pokemon cards. So we're going to start off with uh, a common card. So this is an example. Bergmite, this is a common card. So the way that we tell that this is a common card is we go down to this uh, bottom uh, left hand corner and you can see there guys, there is a black circle there guys. So that black circle will show that it's uh, a common card. Usually these are frequent cards. So you'll pull these very regular. Uh, normally as well guys, as you'll see, common cards are normally basic cards. Uh, basic cards normally uh, don't evolve or the, the, the first evolution uh, of a card guys. So that is a common card for you lot and that's how we tell a common card. So the next one guys uh, is an uncommon card. So that there, sweet honey. So again, we go down to this bottom left hand corner and an uncommon card is this diamond shape. So normally uh, they are, it doesn't say it on this card, but normally they're stage one cards. Uh, they can usually, a stage one card is that they, they've evolved once, uh, but they can also be uh, a basic one as well. Um, but yeah, so Diamond Guys would be an uncommon card. We then have a rare. So, Rapidash. So, again, we go down to this bottom corner, and as you can see, we've got uh, a black star. So, this, guys, would be a rare card. Uh, normally... Uh, well, you can get these in basic, you can also get them as a stage one or a stage two. So, next guys will be an ultra rare card. So, ultra rare cards, I have two examples here guys. So, ultra rare, again, Everything that we need to know is down in this bottom left hand corner. So an ultra rare card is a star, but if you look at this star, it's not black. It's like a, a shiny silver uh, color. Uh, normally your ultra rare cards are gonna be either like your Vs um, or like your GXs uh, or your V Max. Um, these can be uh, a stage one or a stage two um, or you can get them basic. Um, pull rates for these guys usually, so if you had uh, a booster box of 36 packs, uh, you'd be looking at uh, every six packs or so, guys, you'd probably get one of these cards, guys. Um, so there you go, guys, that is the ultra rare. Then we're looking at promotional cards, guys. So. These uh, are usually found in tins or events. So the ones that I've got here, guys, um, these are from Hidden Fates tins that I've uh, that I've got. And again, we go down to this bottom corner, and you can actually see a star, and you can see that it says promo. So that would be the when you've got the tin in the the top of the tin, the little picture that you would see uh, in the top of the tin. So, there you go, guys. I haven't got uh, any promos from an event, um, but again, yeah, they, they do them in all kinds of different uh, things that you can get, guys, but that's how you tell anyway. It says promo in the star. Then, guys, we're going to look at uh, the secret rare is next, guys. So, your secret rare... Uh, usually guys is uh, a full art card so again we're going to go down here into this bottom corner and this is going to tell us everything that we need to know so again you can see that star down there guys um that star silver shiny star and then what we're going to do is we're going to another big giveaway is going to be these numbers down here guys so um this number here is the number of cards in the set 
So uh, this set is Astral Radiance. And this is how you can tell what set you're looking at as well, guys. So this little picture here uh, is different on uh, each set. So like I said, guys, this is Astral Radiance. And this number on this side here, so there's 215, um, that is the number of this card. But you're going to say to yourself, why is that number bigger than the amount in the set? So what that means is that basically uh, any number above that 189 is going to be a secret rare. So in Astral Radiance, there's 26, guys, 26 cards that are your secret rares. Um, this just happens to be uh, a gold card. So again, guys, that is a secret rare. Then I've also got another type of secret rare. Um, again, we're looking at uh, a, a shiny star. So down here, guys, you can see we've got the the like the silver shiny star. Um, but on this, we've again, obviously, guys, it's uh, a full art. Um, but we look down here, and you can see the symbols different. So if I bring back the the other one. So this one, guys, is Astral Radiance. So that little picture there shows Astral Radiance. And this is from uh, Brilliant Stars, guys. So you can see that them two are both, both different. So in this one, guys, you can see that it's got a uh, TG. So this is a, a Trainer Gallery card. So... There you go, that's how you tell uh, the difference there, guys. That's got TG, so this is number 11. And in the trainer gallery of the uh, the secret rares, that is 11. And there are 30 cards, uh, uh, secret rares, that are trainers. So, there you go, guys. So, uh, and then last of all is, you will end up with uh, cards that could have the same symbol... Uh, but uh, they look different, guys. So, got a few examples here. So, uh, we've got four, actually, different prints, guys. So, this is uh, just a normal print. So, as you can see, uh, we've got nothing that's shiny on there. No holographic whatsoever, guys. Uh, so, that is a normal printed card. Um Next in line would be, and I will take it out of the sleeve just so you can see it better. So if you look at this, guys, this is what's known as a reverse hollow. So a reverse hollow, uh, you can see it shiny. So all of this area around the artwork, so this is the artwork itself, guys. So all of this area that's blue um, will be holographic, guys. So this card is known as a reverse holo, guys. Then we've got a holographic. So again, I'll just take it out of its sleeve. So a holographic card, guys, is the opposite of what this is. So if you look... Uh, round here, round the artwork, is a normal card. But the hollow itself on this card is in the actual artwork design. So this one is uh, a holographic, guys. Now, I don't have an example, but there is a fourth type of card, and that is uh, a special holographic. So you will get special holographics in, uh, like... Promotional sets or sets like from McDonald's uh, and what they'll do is they'll look just like this But the holographic up here will be uh, different and unique um, They won't look like uh, Like a normal holographic so um, Bit hard because I don't have one to show you guys, but yeah, so that's the four types guys. So yeah, if uh, you do have any questions, just ask. I'm new to this myself and I'm learning. I hope you find this uh, uh, helpful for you guys. Again, I am a small channel that's trying to grow, guys. Um, so I do appreciate any uh, any feedback. Um, and if you guys would, like, share, subscribe and leave a comment, guys. And thanks for watching and I shall uh, see you on the next one.